And the family is lucky to be alive after their home caught fire because of someone who was setting off illegal fireworks. This video from the fire was posted on the Citizen app. Fox 11's Christina Gonzalez, live in Palmdale, after speaking with a devastated family who's now trying to pick up the pieces. Christina? You know, and let me tell you, firefighters, I don't know if you can see from my hair, which I had to pick up, how windy it is today, how breezy, 107 degrees is what my temperature gauge is saying. Firefighters are saying they're lucky it wasn't this breezy when this happened. Take a look at this. The house completely, completely destroyed. The family is having to live in this RV that actually a neighbor has lent to them because the whole place is gone, everything they owned. Take a look at this. Even from a distance, you can feel the emotion as family members escort Christina Rivas on the first time she sees what's left of her home. She was out of town when the Palmdale house, the family built over 20 years ago, exploded in flames Sunday night with her mother and two daughters in it. All of a sudden I hear like a boom. She says someone was setting illegal fireworks in the empty fields behind their neighborhood when at least one hit the house, breaking a sliding glass door. My sister had gone to pick something up off it the was, floor. Yeah, it was, if she didn't duck, she would have gotten hit by the fire. Well, it would have got killed the glass. The, the exploded. The, the back window exploded. It knocked her, cut her up, bruised her. They escape alive, but the house is totaled. The family, seven of them, living in a trailer that somebody has lent them. <laughs> Cleanup crews getting ready to secure the burned out shell of the home, but they pause to let Christina and her family take a look. It's, it's, um, it's a lot. It's a lot to now to lose somewhere you grew up in. And you can see it's heartbreaking. Uh, at six o'clock, you're going to hear from Christina. She was upset initially, but she decided to talk to us. And you're going to hear what she has to say at six. Uh, neighbors have set up all kinds of fundraisers for them to help them out. All that on our website at foxla.com. Sheriff saying, please, if anyone knows anything about this, to give them a call. They are concerned. Fireworks are illegal out here, and they're still hearing them. They're arresting people. If anybody knows anything about what happened here last Sunday, please give them a call. If this kind of breeziness continues and these kinds of temperatures continue, which that is the expectation, they're worried about this weekend. So hopefully people will see this and see what can happen and maybe stop.